Thanks for getting me drunk. Uh, it's Ben Kaplan with the National Post here with Evan Bedell. We're at Tanya Salvador Darling, and we're here for five shots. Evan, it's Toronto Canada Fashion Week. Does anyone care? I mean, people in Canada care. People in Toronto care, you know. I care much about that as I care about this. <laughs> so what are you seeing, though? What's the, what are people going to be wearing this fall? Um, probably some black and some fur and... I don't know, I think people like wear their egos and you can really like, people wear their insecurities, people wear whatever's trendy and then it's all this kind of the same thing. You live in Brooklyn now, you used to live here, you've lived in Vancouver, where are they worst dressed? What? The worst dressed people in the world live in Vancouver, British <laughs> Columbia. <laughs> and what would you do to qualify as one of the worst dressed? What would you be wearing? You'd be wearing Lululemon with Uggs and a Canada Goose jacket. Now, shot. <laughs> you're right. Sorry. <laughs> now, Project Runway. Oh my God, Project Runway. Well, I'm happy Iman hosted it because uh, yeah, she is awesome. That's cool. And I kind of thought I was gonna have to call her mom now, and Bowie dad, but that didn't happen. <sighs> Oh, well. Give us a sense though. I mean, you're like a last, like everybody watches reality shows. You're like a living person who came up there and was like famous on that. What happens after the show is done? Well, when the show's done, you're kind of like, you have this bit of like, oh my God, I fucking did it. I did it. And I was 23 and I'm like, you don't really have an idea of what like real business is. Or I didn't anyway. Um, but they give you this facade of it and they create this like, this world that you live in and you're like killing it in that fictitious world. Right. But then you're like, oh, then you're in the real world again. You're like, fuck, get me back to that novel but, I was in because that was way more interesting because now it's boring. Shot. Shot. <laughs> Where are you finding your new inspirations? In the people around me, I find inspiration at Burning Man. I definitely want to go to Berlin. I definitely want to be back in Toronto for the summer and like that really sticky, gross, hot because I like the way people look when they're shiny on their skin and, and they have a bit of a tan and they stink. <laughs> so that's inspiring to me though, like real shit, not right. like, I don't know, purple. <laughs> if there was a, if there was anyone, if there was anyone you could make, if there's anyone you could bring in here, who would you the fourth person you'd want in here drinking shots with you right now? Right now, probably Stacey McKenzie and that probably could have happened. <laughs> She doesn't drink, though. <laughs> <laughs> she just seems like she drinks a lot. But she doesn't. Five isn't enough. Five's never enough. <laughs> Six. It's a lucky number. Mm. That's the way. Woo.